Hello, kittens. I mean, big cats. Big cats. I said big cats. I'm sorry. Hi, big cats. My name's Michael. My wife left me. What's new? Nothing. That's what. Anyway, welcome back to Call of Duty World at War, uh, which is something I haven't yet to play on the channel. I know there's a glitch at one point. I don't know if it still exists. I'm sure they patched it, but like you can get on top of the staircase and there's a pile of glitch there. So that's pretty funny. So yeah, I'm not going to be spending too long on each map. How how do I check my kills? Don't, don't answer that. I just see mission objectives. Why is this the thing? I never saw this back in the day. This is so weird. You know what else is crazy is how they put transit in this map. You know, like it's just such a I, I try to make a dumb joke there. Just laugh, please. Uh, this is my only sense of self-esteem at this point. To be honest with you, like, spending 10 minutes on Knocked Around Totem, not my ideal Friday night, or Friday morning, I guess, to say to say the least, because it is Friday, and it is technically the morning. It's around 1.51 p.m., about around two hours since I've started doing this bullshit that I called my greatest idea ever, or I think I called it the worst idea I've ever had. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I decided to see, hey, how many videos can I make in one night? And this is what I get. I, I plan on going up until, like, 6 a.m., because FNAF references. Oh, another thing that I think is funny is that, um, you know, like, in these videos, I talked about or I've told all of you is that, you know, I'm, I'm actually a manager now at the place I work at and very funny stuff happened today. You might be wondering, well, what am I talking about? And, that, and that's a great question. I mean, that's only logical that you're thinking that. And I, I do want to say is that like, as of today, um, I had to explain to one of the, one of the, one of the employees, I mean, I'm an employee too, but you get what I'm saying, like as a context. So I had to explain to them Five Nights at Freddy's lore. And you might be wondering why. Uh, I don't think that's really important on, you know, you don't, you don't have to know uh, why I, why I had to explain to them that the bite of 87 uh, was not an inside job. I mean, it was an inside job. Technically, it, it really was an inside job. You know, to be honest with you, the car, not that bad. Not that bad. I don't know why people complain about this gun so much. I mean, it gets headshots, which is what you want. It gets you the most points, I think, compared to whatever the fuck. I mean, I guess that thing does the same thing at the end of the day. But I think the Card 98 makes you a better zombies player. I mean, everyone wants this thing to get nerfed nowadays in Warzone. Honestly, this is going to sound really stupid, but I, I am really enjoying Knocked Around Toten. I know it's only round three and I only have four minutes left on this map, but honestly, probably the most fun I've had on this map in years. I'm kind of upset that they put gobble gum and uh, perks on this map in BO3 because I think um, they could could have uh, made the game suck. like just the map is some type of joke to you. I I, I immediately don't like this map anymore. I, I really don't want to talk about this map anymore. This thing to do at this point is just keep hitting the box. Uh, very funny thing if you ask me. The card 98 is still superior to the bar. And it's still good. It still gets headshots. The bar, I, I tried getting a headshot. It's just no. It's the only answer I received and the only answer I'll ever get. Now, funny enough, I know it, with World of War maps, um, there's something broken on each and every one of them. And I know uh, with I know with Nocturne and Toten, I know what that is with Nocturne and Toten. It's really stupid. Uh, all you have to do is keep running around and the zombies can't hit you for some reason as long as you're moving uh the zombies or I, I don't know if it's as long as you're moving or as long as you're running the zombies can't hit you so you can like really run really up close to them and not get hit it, it's like the dumbest thing shino numa i believe the rounds are broken i believe don't quote me on that like in the later rounds like only 24 zombies spawn in the higher rounds i don't know why that is don't quote me on that though uh Verrucked, obviously we all know Verrucked. um the zombies are broken in Verrucked. i think it's the only map that the zombies are actually bullshit like you know the zombies just run super Super duper fast on that map, which is why the term, you know, we all know it. Varuk Spinners, we all know them. We all hate them, but they're a reality for some fucking reason. I don't know who thought that was a good idea to bring them back, but fuck you. It made zombies, it made zombies like McDonald's, you know, just very fast food, repetitive bullshit. It's just, I don't know. In my opinion, I, I think that sprinting and zombies kind of ruined it. I, I think it took a lot of strategy out of the mode, but eh. I mean, and then again, I mean, you can argue that it even adds strategy, added strategy to the mode in a way. Uh, you can argue both ways, but at the end of the day, um, I'm wrong. You're probably right. Uh, my wife left me for another man. But one thing I, I love though is that it starts off really slow, but like it's only round five and it already feels like round five, to be honest with you, because I don't know how else it could feel like another round besides round uh, five, because that'd be kind of quirky and weird if it wasn't. Uh, another thing I realized is that with World at War, I can technically play these custom zombies with World at War, which is really weird. I, I, I'm honestly surprised I have never done it or tried it because I, I don't know. World at War custom apps I've heard are definitely superior than BO3 ones because with BO3 ones like anyone can technically make a BO3 custom zombies map whereas a world at war custom zombies not anyone can make it like you actually have to give a shit about map making in order to make a custom zombies map in world at war so obviously the custom zombies maps in world at war are superior uh in my opinion at least that's what I've heard I wouldn't I believe it too like I don't doubt that for a second suck my balls idiot idiot suck my balls my wife left me goodbye Kevin all right and that is that with this map I am done. I'm done. I'm done with this map. Okay, next map. Next map.